So step number one is finding seed keywords you want to rank organically for in Google search. You want to eventually rank for many keywords, but start by focusing on a keyword that you will positively rank number one for in Google search. So as you can see in this screenshot of Google search, I rank for both single keywords and multiple word keywords. These are called long tail keywords. Now most of my clients think they should rank for single keywords, the keywords with the highest search volumes. Now yes, ranking for those 5,000 search volume to 1 million plus search volume, single keywords sounds awesome. But the competition to rank for those single keywords is nearly impossible. You need backlinks, an aged and trusted domain, a ton of relevant content, and you still might not rank for these highly competitive one word keyword phrases. It's the two to three keyword phrases and longer that you want to target and that I target for my clients. Look at this graphic. If your site sells shoes, don't even try to rank for that generic search phrase. Rather create a blog or a page with titles and meta descriptions using these long tail keywords, such as men's shoe size, insert size, or red Nike men's running shoes. There's a great long tail keyword. These are longer keyword phrases that yes, are searched less than the keyword shoes alone. But these long tail keywords are easier to rank for in Google. Now think about long tail keywords for a second. When people search for shoes online, do they just type in the keyword shoes? Sometimes yes, but for the most part, that is just one keyword from the long tail keyword most people search for. For example, cheap red Converse shoe size 10. Now that's a great long tail keyword that we can go and research and find out if it's worth creating an article around, worth creating a product around, and worth ranking for in Google. 